Reforming the BPD 101 with Baltimore's police commissioner from the mayor scandal to the crime fight. Hello, everybody. I'm Rick Renner. And I'm Denise Co. Commissioner Michael Harrison is making his mark on the city's police department with big changes to the command staff. He's also dealing with violence the city can't seem to shake and a scandal involving his boss, Mayor Pugh, that has dominated headlines. WJZ investigator Mike Helgren is live at police headquarters where he spoke to Harrison today about the tough job ahead. Mike? A lot of challenges, Denise and Rick. The commissioner said he felt management in the department was top heavy and inefficient, so he is downsizing. He also says he is focused on his job and not the problems of the mayor who brought him here. I'm unaffected by really what's going on around us. Commissioner Michael Harrison tells WJZ he's moving forward with reforms in the Baltimore City Police Department and not letting the scandal over Mayor Pugh and her healthy Holly books distract him. You still feel like you have full support for your vision for the department? It has not impacted me at all, and yes, I feel like I have full support from our, our mayor, ex officio, and uh, from every member of the city council. Harrison is reorganizing the command staff, reducing the number of lieutenants and lieutenant colonels. There are fewer people at the top, and the people in those positions know exactly who their subordinates are. He's also trying to rebuild trust after corruption scandals like the Gun Trace Task Force and is looking for someone to lead a new public integrity bureau. I want that person to be the voice of my voice, and I do not want that person to have anyone override any decision when it comes to internal affairs. Baltimore has seen a spike in shootings and murders in the past week. It's sad. It makes me not want to come out here. It makes me not want to live here. A man was recently killed near this woman's home. She asked us to conceal her identity. Do you think anything's different right now? Um, I have seen a lot more police on the street and pulling them up and, you know, the drug activity. It's the drugs. That's the number one thing. The competition which drives money and drives violence over that, that, that lucrative drug trade, all of that has to be addressed. The police union tweeted that Baltimore is in crisis and accused city leaders of being soft on crime. While Governor Hogan said last week the state needs tougher laws targeting repeat violent offenders. He offered a vote of confidence in Commissioner Harrison. But I think we've got the right guy in place now. I left my city and moved all the way here because I thought there was hope. Now those commanders who were demoted can stay on in the department but at a lower rank and lower salary. And there is a nationwide search right now for that deputy commissioner who will lead anti-corruption efforts. Live at City Police Headquarters, Mike Helgren, WJZ.